In this tutorial, we will go over how to assemble the components into a package in the PackageSmart demo project. After logging into PackageSmart, select the PackageSmart demo project on the Build tab. With the components already built, we can now assemble a complete package with primary, secondary, and tertiary packaging plus the shipping distribution. Click on the Package tab in the Build menu and the Select a Package window appears. Let's click on the Super Spray Cleaner Current Design in the All category and then click Select. Let's look at the differences on this screen. On the left, the inventory items you have available for building a package are now components and transport. In the package details section, there is a sales volume unit entry field. This is needed to calculate the cube efficiency if you elected to see these metrics in your project. To the right of the unit volume is the system weight, which is the total weight of all of the packaging divided by the number of selling or consumer units. PackageSmart calculates this weight as you build the package. You do not need to enter it. Just below the unit volume and system weight are four tabs where you will be building your package. Just like we have done before, you will select items from the available inventory on the left and then double click or drag them into your primary, secondary, and tertiary packaging. You also bring transport inventory over into the transport tab to model your distribution transport. Let's now take a closer look at each entry screen for the four parts of your package. The primary package contains one super spray bottle. Remember this bottle is made up of HDPE, injection molding, and transport. If you forget, you can highlight the component and view how it was built below in the selected assembly or components detail. In addition, the primary package includes one super spray pump. Here you can define the number of uses in your package on the left. Now let's look at the bottom of the primary package details window. Here is where you enter the information for the cube utilization. PackageSmart uses the same calculations as Walmart for calculating primary and tertiary cube utilization. For secondary cube utilization, PackageSmart uses the same logic as Walmart has for primary cube utilization. For the primary package, we are measuring how much space the product and its packaging takes up on the consumer's shelf relative to the amount of product being stored, the unit volume you entered earlier. For the primary package, you enter the number of consumer units over primary package, and then the length, width, and height that the package takes up. Please see our help file for details of how the cube utilization is calculated. The help file is located on the top right of every screen in PackageSmart. Now let's click on the secondary package. Here we added the master case components, which are the 18 by 10 by 10.5 single wall process and the packing tape. We can again define the number of uses and the cube utilization. The units per package is now the consumer units over the secondary package, and the unit measure is now the dimensions of the master case. For this example, the number of units is 12, as 12 super spray cleaners fit in a case. The recalculate button will calculate the cube utilization for you after you make changes. Click on the tertiary tab. This screen is the same as the others. For the cube utilization, you enter the number of consumer units per tertiary package. So in our example, this is 96, the number of spray bottles that are on a pallet. We also want to change the uses of the wood pallet to 10. Click on the transport tab to now model the distribution transport. Here you will bring over transport inventory to model all the legs of your distribution. In this case, we ship 500 miles by rail, then 1,000 miles by ship, and then 500 miles by road. You can also enter the number of tertiary packages. In this 
example that refers to the pallets that can fit on a truck. This field is for your reference only. It is not used in any of the package smart calculations at this time. With one package now built, you can quickly make new packages by copying the first and changing the name and editing the inventory, just like we did before with our components. Let's have a look. Click on the plus icon to open the select a package window. Then highlight the current design item we just looked at. Click on the copy icon on the right and an exact replica of the package with the same name but the word copy in front of it is made. Let's rename this to Recycled Super Spray Cleaner. Now click on the select icon to save and open the package in the Build Package screen. Now edit the package. For this example, let's delete the original Super Spray bottle component in the primary package. And let's add one that's made of recycled plastic. You will select the recycled Super Spray bottle component from your inventory list on the left and then double click or drag it over to the package details window. When you're done editing, save your new package. This concludes the Package Smart demo project building the package tutorial. The next tutorial in this series is Package Smart demo project analyzing the package. If you have any questions, email support at earthshift.com or dial 802-434-3326 extension 2.